too for a second? Yeah, what up? In private? Cece, go ahead. Okay, well, I thought we were supposed to be having a private meeting today to discuss business. Cece, what you think we're doing? Am I talking to you? <laughs> you know what? Y'all ain't talking business. Y'all talking nonsense. We were actually discussing the questionable nature of the promotional strategy that you and Dom have employed on Freak's behalf. Now, it doesn't necessarily resonate with his core fan base, primarily due to the fact that it negates the legitimacy of his personal background and history in favor of reaching a larger, primarily more disinterested demographic that would prefer to judge Freak's past as opposed to appreciate it. <laughs> Yo, what Yvette said. Four times 25, 100. Oh, so now you know your times tables. Yvette, occasionally proving that you're articulate doesn't mean you have business acumen. Beyond, of course, your clear mastery of basic arithmetic, we all know you can add up how much freak makes. Okay, Cece, that's enough. <laughs> no, no, you know what, Cece? You're absolutely Anywho, right. Freak, and the speaking of basic arithmetic, how much of Freak's money do you take? Okay, I mean, what did I just say manager? about oh, team what? Freak? A manager? What did I just say about team no. Freak? The only members of Good. team Freak in here are me and you. Oh, you know what, Cece? This isn't the womb, okay? It's not just you and Freak. Speaking of, how's that going for you? Hey, come on. Oh, snap! You gonna let hey. her talk to me Yo. like that, really? You need to check on me. I'm not Yo, even talking her. about now. Yeah. Yo, I'm out. You know what? I think I'm I'll out. join oh, you. No, 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 no. Darlings, please. Please have a seat. I would just love to hear what you all were just discussing. Better yet, let me guess. Hmm. Hey, yo, I'm saying, dude, what you need to do is hit up these parties. Yeah, you need to show these fools how you still have mad love for the hood. Get you some flossy jewels. Make sure every time they see you whistling the new whip. Better yet, let's get us a dealership or a club or something. Never mind that house you promised your twin sister you promised you get for your parents who are still in the projects where you left them. Yo, that's not fair. I ain't leaving my ass. Hey, and you know I'll never leave our parents a project. Thing, fam. I'll take care of everything. All you got to do is break me off with that bread. Yeah, that's what I thought. Wow. You know what, Cece? I don't know what's going on with you tonight, but I think it's best you go home. We will continue our meeting here. You asking me to leave? Yes. Hey, yo, freak. It's all good, man. As a matter of fact, Cece, now, I know you don't like me. You never have. Now, I don't know what I ever did to you. But at this point, does it really matter anymore? Look, I just want you to know that I'm really sorry for whatever it was. I can honestly say it was not intentional. All right? Hey, Freak, think about what I said earlier, man. I ain't trying to catch no charge. Vet, you ready? Yes, ma'am. Cece, you know I love you more than life itself. And how come you always put them before me? I don't put anyone above you, not even myself. You sure about that, Cece? What would you just call all this? I mean, you come in here blowing up my spot and you insult my brother? He's not our brother. You disrespect my woman. <laughs> He's trying to protect you. From who? From the likes of you? But you don't think I realize that I have vultures and blood-sucking leeches in my life? Don't think I realize that you're one of them? Blood-sucking? Yeah, but you know what? That's what I think the problem is. It's because you realize you're no better than them and you're ashamed. But in fact, you're worse because we share the same blood. And just because they don't have the same blood running through their veins as us doesn't mean that they don't love me. Yeah, their love might be flawed, but it's true. What you need to understand is I don't need you to protect me anymore. I don't mind the people closest to me leeching off me. Yes, you do leech off me, and I leech off you too. You love business and you love me. I use that. Vic? Uh, Vic? You know you don't mind running these streets. He's my connection to things I don't want to deal with anymore, so I let him do him. I take care of him, and in return, he looks out for me in places you know you can't. And as much as you don't want to hear this, we 
bet she is the eye of the storm in my life right now. She is my only calm. She's my peace, my shelter. I use these people and they use me. I just don't call it that, CeCe. I don't call what you do using me. I call what you do caring for me. Forgive yourself and forgive them for using the resources at their disposal to get what they need. And what you need to learn to do is just trust me. Okay, I've always had a good judge of character, even before I was born. Remember? Because I chose to come in this world with you. That's right. It was me and you in the womb just kicking it. Right? Right? I was born first. <laughs> yeah, you were. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Swish. Some people say you just a hang around, that you're a leech. Why is that the word? John Wall. I'm psyched for this one. Dude is tough as nails. You know you're in for a battle when you're up against him. Big matchup for this team, big matchup for me. We shut him down, we win this game, period. So that's what I'm gonna try to do. really want to change teams I don't like the Pacers no offense to Pacer fans anywhere but I'd rather be on Miami you it's the Wizards we should beat these guys Or not, they have 13, okay. Oh my god. Fuck. Get up, get up, get up. Yeah, 
There we go. What? Man, get real. Get real. Well, at least he didn't make it, so. Wait, Chris Humphreys plays for the Wizards now? What the fuck? Oh my god. With a big sweep against a pretty good Raptors team. Yeah, how about taking them down four straight? And it is the first time a team has swept an opponent without home court advantage since 2011. Also, was the first sweep for the Wizards team. Uh. They hold the early advantage on the glass. Yeah, nothing made not a huge advantage, but certainly a good sign for them. There we go. Great job in his team. I'll take that. And in the second round, the Wizards continued to be a tough opponent. I mean, they went up 2-1 on the Hawks, but were unable to keep the series lead. A lot of close, heartbreaking losses for them in that series. And the Wizards with possession. Tough loss coming against Cleveland in their last game play. Probably their poorest defensive effort all season long. I mean, at home, that kind of beat is not going to cut it. Never mind. Oh my god, they just made it three. No. Alright. And the Hawks would ultimately take down the Wizards last year in the postseason. John Wall and his injury were a big turning point in that matchup. And all those buzzer beaters for both teams made it one of the most interesting series of the postseason. And Neil gets the session. Pass to Neil on the space. It's rebounded by Indiana. Defeated by the Hornets in their last game. They'll try to put that one behind him. You're fucking kidding me, dude. Oh my god. The shooting in this this year's game is just a lot worse. I don't like it. I think I had that on my Stuck in against the three. 